welcome back to my channel or hi hello if you are new here. Today I'm going to be doing an inspired makeup tutorial inspired by Taylor Swift's Are You Ready for a Music video. So let's just go ahead and get right on into it. So starting out with my shadow, I'm going to use the shade Chaser in my crease as my transition shade. And I'm just going to be using my Urban Decay Naked Heat Palette for this makeup tutorial. You guys are going to see a, another tutorial with this palette really soon. So, yeah, I'm really sorry you guys are going to see this palette being used back to back, but I just love it. It's my baby. Going in with the shade Low Blow, which is just that matte brown right there, I'm going to put that onto my lid as my lid color, and to apply it, I'm going to use the e.l.f. eyeshadow brush. Going in with the shade Sauce, I'm going to put that into my crease as my overall crease color. Now I'm just going to use the fluffy side of the Urban Decay brush and I'm just going to blend everything out. So I just took some concealer and I cleaned up the edges just a little bit where I had blended out that eyeshadow a little bit too far line out of my eye line. And I'm going to do a beauty hacks video really, really soon. So you guys will see that little tip in that video. So stay tuned for that. But now I'm going to curl my lashes and I'm going to put on some mascara. So we are done with the eyes. I know Taylor Swift had a winged liner on in the music video, but I cannot, for the life of me, do eyeliner on myself. I can do it on other people. I just cannot do it on myself. So we're just going to skip that, and that's why this is called an inspired look because this doesn't really technically really look anything identical to Taylor Swift's look. This is just kind of inspired by it. But anyway, now we are going to do some contouring. And I'm going to use that contour shade right there for my Sephora palette. And Taylor actually was very contoured in the video. And I don't really do contouring that much anymore. So I really wanted to do it. So that is what we are going to do. Okay, so off camera, I just took this angled up blush brush from e.l.f. And I just blended out where I kind of had messed up on that contour a little bit. And just made sure that it was all a little bit more blended out. Because even though I really like this little fish brush for contouring my face, it really does get into like the little corners of my jaw very nicely and all. But 
it doesn't really blend it out that well, so I always have to grab another brush to kind of blend out my contour with, but other than that, I really do like this little fish brush for contouring, so now I'm going to move on and apply some bronzer to my face because Taylor did have just a little bit of bronzer on, so I'm going to be using the matte bronzer from my Ulta Cheek Palette. I literally use this bronzer in every single tutorial, and I'm so, so sorry, but I really just like this bronzer, so yeah. Okay, so I'm pretty sure Taylor Swift was not wearing highlighter in her video, but I gotta have some sort of a glow. So, I am going to use this very, very subtle highlight from this Elf total face palette this is just a really subtle beautiful natural highlighter i actually use this every single day and i love it so i am just going to apply that to the high points of my face all right so i'm getting a little bit ahead of myself today because i always do my blush and then my highlighter, but I guess I'm going to do my highlighter and then my blush today. So the blush that I'm going to be using is just the Tarte Amazonian Clay 12 Hour Blush in the shade Parte. This is just a really dark mauve blush and this really matches the blush shade that she was wearing in the video. So that is just the one that I'm going to be using today and I actually busted it and there's only like a little bit left right there in the corner, but I'm just going to work with what I have. And then for lips, I'm going to be using this Wet n Wild Mega Lip Color in the shade Birthday Suit. This is kind of like a pinkish nude color. I don't really know how to describe it. It's kind of got like a mauve with like a pin of pink with like a hint of like a brown. Um, it's really pretty and it looks per almost pretty identical to the lip color that she was wearing in the music video. So I'm just going to apply this straight to my lips. And we are done. Alright everyone, so that's it for this video. Thank you guys so much for watching this. And I will see you all in the next one very, very soon. Bye guys, thanks for watching.